Assalamualaikum everyone. So today uh, we want to do the video record series. Uh, we are from Lab 003 movie review from group 42. So now uh, I want to introduce my name. My name is Nur Emila Binti Mama Saad and my metric number 20203. Assalamualaikum everyone. Uh, my name is Muhammad Halif Muhammad Fazli. Everyone can call me Halif. Uh, currently, I'm taking Bachelor of Communication with Anas, and now uh, and my metric number is two zero six eight six seven. Hi, assalamualaikum, madam, and hi everyone. So my name is Mamal Fatih Bisudin, and my metric number is two zero three four six five. And currently, I'm taking the Bachelor of Human Development Science. Hi, my name is Fatin Amira Binti Mumisham and my metric number is 207236. Uh, I'm currently taking Bachelor of Art in Malay Language and Linguistics. Nice to meet you guys. Hi, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nuraya Stasha Binti Abu Sama. My metric number is 207129. I'm currently taking Bachelor Communication. Hi guys, my name is Alia Maisara. My matrix number is 200268 and currently I'm taking Computer and Communication System Engineering. Hello guys, my name is Amira Tila My matrix number is 200806 and currently I'm taking Bachelor of Science in Agribusiness. Hello guys, my name is Nora Satirani Binti Mama Kusraini. My matrix number is 200088. Currently, uh, I'm taking Bachelor Economics. Assalamualaikum and good evening. I wish to madam and my friends. My name is Nia Rashika Binti Nia Roslan. My number is 208033. Currently, I'm first year student of Bachelor Mathematical and Science with Honors. Nice to meet all of you here again for discussion six, and I hope that we can have a fruitful discussion today. Just that from me, thank you. Hi, Assalamualaikum, uh, Madam and my fellow friends. My name is Jamila Binti Abubakar with matrix number 201990. Yeah, we meet again. Uh, and currently I am taking um, Bachelor Science of Human Development and Let's start our discussion. So guys, who have watched the movie? Yes, okay, everyone, I, I have watched. Yes. 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 Very interesting, amazing and fantastic and so on. Uh, <laughs> Very uh, nice. So anyone uh, want to share the storyline? It's okay, let me start, okay? Okay. <laughs> uh, Mulan is more an action drama. Um, it does not cater younger audience. And live action remakes or, or, or something like uh, Lion King or Aladdin did because it's more like uh, animation, right? Um, yeah. But, um, okay, um, something that attract me is that Mulan is the most expensive film it's ever made by a woman director and estimated 200 million production budget. It's a very big penny. And yeah, uh, it's, uh, Mulan is played by Yi Fei Liu, the daughter of Zima, a proud former fighter who is now too frail to battle. Mulan must disguise herself as a man in order to enter the Chinese army when Bori Khan, played by Jason Scott Lee, leads his forces to sack the empire. Mulan is aware that her deceit will cause her family embarrassment and potentially a death sentence if she is discovered. But she would rather face such repercussions than place her father in danger. Uh, she had struggled to conceal her true identity while proving her worth as a soldier. And uh, although one of the witches and Wu Zia style acrobatic battle scenes. Mulan, um, with this logistic of becoming a woman in men clothing, are the only new aspect in this remake that it's something emotional. Her avoidance of the group showers, 
and the resultant order um, provide all two briefs respite from the convoluted plot in which the nomads attack and the Chinese search are difficult to navigate ge ge geographically. And I found out this uh, film is quite, um, it's quite, uh, how to say this, um, something like frightening also la, when uh, woman in action. What do you think, guys? I believe it is a story of a young girl who sacrificed herself to fight uh, the evaders. And by seeing his father struggling a lot in practicing to fight at their home, as the kingdom requested, all house must send a man to uh, join the soldiers. I, uh, she is she very really determined to, to force herself to do something out of norm, which is to be to pretend to be a soldier, a male soldier, because the kingdom refused to uh, for a woman to be a soldier. And so basically, I really love the trailer. Yeah, the first thing I do is I watch the trailer, and it was made perfectly that triggered me to watch more. And as expected, it never disappoints me. And the storyline is impressive, just like what Kajimin has said before. And I would like to admit that Mulan live action movie is improving a lot rather than the animation one made since 1988. And I think that is from me. What about others? Hey guys. We go. Go for study. So, yeah, basically, uh, I appreciate that everyone choose my gender uh, for the last discussion and yeah and there's a good uh, explanation from Jam uh, Jamilah and uh, Amira about the Mulan. Uh, I, I want to talk more about the Mulan because I, I watched suggested movie. I was uh, tell you guys to watch the movie because I already already know the storyline, the, the what happened in the movie and what can we learn, what le the lesson can we learn and yeah like I said uh, it's about the the hero is a woman and mostly uh, it, uh, the movie will at, uh, our self to become a more brave become a uh, truth woman in the world and yeah like in this movie show us everything that we need to be in ourselves. We need to be brave. We need to be the truth in ourselves. We need to more and more more story in the movie. So uh, I really appreciate you guys watch the movie and have fun for watch this movie. That's for me. Okay, uh, thank you, Haile. Uh, so um yeah so what i can review for this movie is first i really like that the mulan the mulan uh, when the mulan uh, enter to the camp and become a soldier so uh she is very brave because um uh, she can hide her identity uh, until uh, she um, not go to bath for a long time, maybe a few days, um, yeah. until uh, her friends say that um, her body is uh, smelly. So, uh, so at the night, uh, she go to lake and go to bath. So uh, the point is the brave. She is very brave. She is very, um, what we call, um, uh, the, uh, she have the soldier soul, means the warrior soul in her life. So, uh, second, I very amazed with her because, um, when she saved the emperor, emperor life. Uh, so, um, what I can say that, 
uh, she really brave uh, when she um fight with the the with that guy with the bad guy so um that we can say that the the guy is very strong and very incredible when the woman fight with the man so uh this this uh, movie uh show that woman is um is uh, can uh strong than men uh so uh the power that, of woman yeah the power of woman actually <laughs> so uh that i can review for this movie and overall i think that this movie is very good uh for hmm. all of stages can um uh each of stages can us uh, can watch this because this movie uh, have a lot of moral value uh so that's all from me so uh, what what you think guys sorry uh, okay need Rashika first okay uh sorry because i cannot agree with you all you two yeah behind this good storyline there is also a bad thing about this movie that i found out before uh because after i watched uh, this movie i also heard some bad news about this uh film uh where disney tank a government body in Xinjiang, a western province in china where around 2 million uyghur uh, uyghur muslim have been uh, forced into concentration camps by the by the chinese government it turns out part of mulan were filmed in xinjiang two years ago uh, well after the world knew about beijing plans to re-educate uyghur muslim with communist party doctrine that's simply shocking to me uh, as there's no excuse for disney executive uh, to have been unaware about uh, human right abuse taking place just my from the film site Plus, the film had counter controversy for some time as it leaked actress last year, supporter uh, Hong Kong law enforcement of a pro-democracy protester, which leaked to the hashtag boycott Mulan on social media movement. Due to that controversy, it bring me to the Twitter and I saw it trending number one at that time. And I'm very shocked what happened actually. So I put some effort uh, with trying to Google it on internet until I found about one article that told me that the true story and after that this film was boycott due to China government had do something not nice to our Uyghur Muslim brother and sister there. So from that I told to myself by hood or by crook that I will support our Muslim people there by boycott this movie even though I have watched last uh, last year and also last week. I feel a uh, pity uh, for them. For several years now, China has been systematically uh, repressing its Uyghur Muslim minority in that region, subjecting men, women, and children to torture, sexual abuse, forced sexualization, family separation, and brainwashing, among other horrors. They add to Chinese government other abuses, such as banning oppressions of Islamic faith. I also found about one hadith that written by Imam Bukhari, which he said that our prophet Rasulullah reminds us of this golden rule, uh, which is uh, none of you has faith until he loved for his brother what he loved for himself. So due to this hadith, I think there is no excuse anymore for me to support this movie. And I have to repent after this because I have uh, watched the movie um and i will uh, stay by uh, by side of our Uyghur muslim brother and sister there to show that i always support them and i know that some of us maybe have different opinion but when you ask me so that that are uh, my solid answer why i do not agree to support this movie anymore like what i said before so how about you guys Okay, I agree with uh, Nick Rashika, but um, this movie, I learned, I learned, um, women need to uh, be brave because uh, not, uh, uh, women need to be brave because uh, Mulan film tell the story of the young Chinese woman who disguised herself as a woman, as a man, to fight as her father. 
as a children, Mulan was burning with task for, uh, of taking her honor for her family. The Mulan nurture the pool of family first be, should be an example for society because as a children, they should respond for her parents. Mulan show Mulan who do not want to her father to go for wars because uh, her father is very, um, I think uh, her father is not uh, help. So uh, Mulan going to replace for her father. So um, Mulan who do not want her father go to war dis disguise her himself as a young, young man and replace her father seeing that the entrance for the far family sent Mushu, a small dragon to help Mulan. Mulan and his friend are then, then sent a uh, war under Shang, comment, and after going through uh, variants. So what I get uh, from this movie, Mulan trusts a lot to all who watch, who watch this movie. How about you guys? So I want to I want to add my opinion. For me, I actually like the animation version of Mulan more because firstly it have uh, the element of comedy, so we can be more relaxed while watching the movie because the live action version is really serious, and also in the live action one it doesn't have the little dragon Mushu which I really like in the animation. But it also has a, a good part of the movie, such as uh, the cast. Um, I think it's um, very good at their job. Um, the group of soldiers uh, look really like real friends and also they have good chemistry. And also uh, the fight is, I think, also quite uh, really interesting to watch. Um, and, but also there's not a lot of blood or gore so i think children can watch this movie but since it is a little serious they can get a little boring for children and also some moral values from this movie i can get is that you cannot succeed on your own i uh, for example uh, mulan can success with, with the help of her friend and next, um, hard work and good work ethic are invaluable. Mulan's plan will have failed and she will not have been able to help her country if she did not have the strong work ethic that she did. So that's all from me. Okay, I also agree with uh, Alia, but I want to add about the most memorable skinny in this movie. Uh, to me, the most memorable scene in this movie, when the part uh, that Mulan has uh, fulfilled that the condition of her third oath, which is honestly, when she start to be a brave and fully honest about her identity, uh, at which point Mulan lets go of her hair and continues to hit into the battle as a woman. Uh, then in a situation uh, where his team almost lost, and Hulan made a very clever plan to beat uh, the enemy. He turned his enemies his toward the snowy mountain. Uh, then his uh, enemy shoot uh, with the fire cannon uh, at the show, uh, at the snowy mountains until um, causing snow to uh, av uh, avalanche. Uh, and then uh, the snow continued to cover his enemy and all that. Due to be a brave and the skill that she had, her eventually become the leader of the movement uh, team to save uh, the king who will be killed by the, his enemies. Okay, the ending uh, of uh, this movie will then achieve uh, the desired goal and begin to be respected to her family and her villages. So uh, from this part that uh, can we follow uh, when we uh, harness with uh, ourselves and others, we are can to be a great and brave person in whatever we do. Okay, that's all for me. What do you guys do? Okay, for me, um, what I love about Mulan is uh, it shows society of men 
also shows uh, how both surprised it and how father and daughter find a new different kind of freedom. Um, the bond between father and daughter and the unity between the battalion is one of the defining points uh, of this movie. The martial art action was spectacular and very typical of a Chinese martial art movie. Lot of magical elements in this movie, some touching parts, some comical areas, and just a fun movie overall. The visual effects were absolutely stunning. The colors and costume were on point. My heart always flutter whenever I see real depiction of history costume. In Mulan, the color of the um, imperial army and the villages were eyes catching and creative. Overall, Mulan is a movie you should watch even once. Even that I read some uh, review and people were judging or comparing this live action to the animated version. And I never like uh, to compare one remake uh, to another because every director and producer uh, has their own vision. So that's what I Uh, I think I like the movie Mulan because uh, she to protect her weak father from the birth of war. Mulan donate drug and snake of the joint to emperor of male army in the fighting against the Huns. Nice uh, gesture, but the girl was a total uh, class. Uh, her true ident identity was only revealed. Uh, by a doctor after uh, a, bat a battle fire injury. Then having, uh, because she having the character be stronger and more impos imposing, those uh, come of a uh, pandering or brutally uh, publicly corrected either is make more sin for the border, more push and pounding than uh, or honor and family. That's all for me. So yeah, what can we see? Uh, everyone may watch, watch happy watching this movie. But I agree with Nick Ashika that uh, this, this the the side of the movie is uh, about the Muslim, about the Islam. But let uh, us uh, discuss about the movie first. What we can learn, what we learn, listen the moral value of the movie. So. Everyone get the moral value, and and then uh, after that we we think about the outside of the movie. So thank you guys for watching it. Oh yeah, I want to add something. I love the scenery. <laughs> okay, that's great. Okay, but so by the way, by the yeah. way, by the way, I just I just would like to respond on uh, children age. Because I think uh, not every children can watch this movie. Uh, if they are about eight years old, then I think uh, they are ready to watch the action movie. But if they are not ready to watch, then better don't don't bring them over like, because they might learn something like um, yeah, something like that. Hmm. They will yeah, fight. Right, <laughs> okay. All right. So I yeah, think most of us has made our mind. So basically, most of us had point out our view on Mulan based on the positive side. But somehow, uh, we might need to reconsider what Nick had been saying. And that made me think deeply about this thing. And I think that all of us uh, must, you know, uh, rethink about it. And uh, I think that's all. Is there anybody who wants to add something? I think no right. Okay. So I think that's all from all of us. Thank you, madam. Thank, Thank you, everyone. Thank you, madam. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone. For the last Bye. video. Thank you. Yo. Bye.